Thanks for watching Glitch Data. Be sure to subscribe and turn on notifications to be notified when I make new content. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to install Fabric, which is essentially a more advanced version of Forge, which means we can install more advanced mods like the Immersive Portals mod. Begin by opening your browser and going to fabricmc.net. Click on the word here under the installation section. This will take you to the download page for the Fabric Launcher. Click on the button that says Download Installer Universal slash Jar. This will download a .jar file that we will use to install the Fabric Launcher. Once the file has downloaded, open your file manager and go to the folder where the Fabric Installer is downloaded. Try double clicking on this file. If this doesn't open the file, right click in an empty space and you should see a button that says either Open in CMD, Open in PowerShell, or Open in Terminal. In my case, it's Terminal. Clicking this button will open a terminal window at this folder. In the terminal window, type Java space hyphen jar space fabric and hit the tab button. This should auto-complete the file name. Hit enter and it will open the fabric installer. Make sure that the client tab is selected at the top and in the Minecraft version dropdown, select the version of Minecraft that you are installing fabric for. In my case, it's 1.16.5. In the loader version, select the latest option. Make sure that the select install location is set to your Minecraft app data folder and that the Create Profile checkbox is ticked. Now hit Install and the Fabric Loader will install into your Minecraft launcher. If you now open your Minecraft launcher, you should see a new profile has been created called Fabric Loader. Now we can run Minecraft to double check that it's installed correctly. Once Minecraft is opened, you should see in the corner some text saying Minecraft, followed by your version, followed by Fabric. This means that Fabric has installed correctly. In order to use most Fabric mods, we will need a mod called the Fabric API. To install this, go back to the Fabric website and click on the link saying Fabric API. This should take you to a CurseForge page. Once on the page, Go to the download section and download the version of Fabric API that corresponds with your Minecraft version by clicking on the orange download button. Once the file is downloaded, open your app data folder by typing percent app data percent into the start menu and hitting enter. Navigate to the .minecraft folder and then the mods folder. Now drag the Fabric API mod into this folder. In order to test that this is fully working, we will install a mod called the Immersive Portals mod. Leave a like and comment down below if you would like me to do a full tutorial on this mod. To install it, search for Immersive Portals mod on your browser and go to the CurseForge page. Again, download the version that corresponds with your Minecraft version. Once it has downloaded, similar to the previous steps, we will drag it into our app data folder and now open Minecraft. Once Minecraft is opened, you should see a new button on the menu that says Mods. By clicking it, it will open the Mod menu where you can see all of the mods that you currently have installed. 
and that's how to install the fabric loader. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like and maybe even consider subscribing. It helps out the channel so much and I'd really appreciate it. Also, it's free and you can always unsubscribe later if you'd like. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.